The 2020 general and regional elections fraud case against former Diana Elections Commission staff and other co-accused began on Monday with local government minister Sonia Parrott testifying that staff from the election agency attempted to subtract votes from the People's Progressive Party, Civic and add them to the then ruling coalition party. During day one of the trial which is being presided over by senior magistrate Leon Daly, Parrott who was then a candidate on the PPP, sees Liz recalled the blatant attempts to steal votes. She testified that that efforts were being made by GECOM staff before her very eyes to alter the results by deducting PPP, C votes and adding votes to the then ruling of PNU, a FC, according to Parrot. She raised strenuous objections. Others such as the current minister within the office of Prime Minister, Queen McCoy, subsequently joined in making objections. She recalled that as she raised her objections, however, persons in the room were also trying to counteract those objections. Parrot also named former G. GECOM official Michelle Miller, one of those on trial, as being the person who read out numbers from what she believed was a spreadsheet. However, some of her testimony was not admitted by the court after objections by defense counsels. The presiding magistrate questioned the relevance of some of the evidence being presented. However, Special Prosecutor Dashan Ramhani noted that the relevance is in GECOM deliberately ignoring the objections of multiple observers in the room. 